Gerard Manley Hopkins was, of course, a Jesuit priest, and he suffered with episodes of very deep depression in which he lost all hope, or almost all hope. And in these episodes, you can feel the conflict between his religious faith and his experience of desolation. In one such episode, he wrote a handful of sonnets, which are amongst his very best work, and surely amongst the best evocations that we have of what it feels like to be in such a desperate state. They're commonly known as the terrible sonnets, and I'll read one or two of these. I hope that they may prove more comforting than despair-making. And indeed, comfort is part of the topic of this next poem. In it, he refers to the comforter, uh, which is the Holy Spirit. Uh, this is a reference to Christ's words about the Holy Spirit. And this poem is called, No Worst, There Is None. No worst, there is none. Pitched past pitch of grief, more pangs will, schooled at four pangs, wilder ring. Comforter, where, where is your comforting? Mary, mother of us, where is your relief? My cries heave, herds long, huddle in a mane, a chief, woe, world sorrow, on an age-old anvil wince and sing, then lull, then leave off. Fury had shrieked, no lingering, let me be fell, force I must be brief. Oh, the mind, mind has mountains, cliffs of fall, frightful, sheer, no man fathomed, hold them cheap, may, who ne'er hung there. Nor does long our small durance deal with that steep or deep. Here, creep, wretch, under a comfort, serves in a whirlwind, all life death does end, and each day dies with sleep. 